Here's Putin resolutely denying any involvement in US politics during an intense public exchange with Megyn Kelly. What the experts say is that this couldn't have been faked, that it's not one factor, that it's a hundred factors that point to Russia. They say it's the forensics, it's the digital fingerprints, it's the IP addresses, the malware, the encryption keys, the specific pieces of code, that all of them, all of them point to Russia and none of them points to anyone other than Russia. Какие отпечатки пальцев? Отпечатки копыт, скажите, рогов, какие, чьи эти отпечатки? Значит, IP-адреса, их можно вообще придумать. Знаете, каких сколько много специалистов? Они сделают так, что это с, и с вашего адреса, с домашнего. Дети ваши послали, младший ваш ребенок трехлетнего возраста. А проблема не у нас, проблема внутри американской политики. Вот в чем проблема. Команда Трампа оказалась более эффективной в ходе избирательной кампании. Я и сам иногда думал, думаю, ну, перебирает мужик, честное слово. Это правда. Но оказалось, но оказалось что, он, что он был прав, а мы хорошие. Это вообще мне антисемитизм напоминает. Во всем евреи виноваты, понимаете? Сам, сам придурок так ничего сделать не может, евреи виноваты. Но, но мы знаем, что к чему приводят такие, такие настроения. Ничем хорошим они не заканчивают. I like him better now I know he's got a secret poodle. <laughs> what about his secret wife? She has to walk it. <laughs> the significance of like, okay, I don't need that anymore. Well, yeah. that, that was like Luke Skywalker on the <laughs> yeah. desk. Yeah. Right? It's like, here we go. It's like Eminem just getting him psyched up. <laughs> It's a very clever thing he does there, which is she gives him a digital fingerprint, yeah. which is a, a tangible thing that you can measure in it. And then he does that thing, which is talking to a room full of, like, bloated 60-year-old oligarchs, going, like, oh, fingerprints? Like, that's... It's a fact. I don't know if you've ever gone out with someone who's a pathological liar, cos I have. <laughs> and um, it's very, very difficult to prove, cos they tell you you're mad. Mm, yeah. There's thing about gaslighting, and you go, but you were there, and you go, I wasn't. Mm. Yeah, I wasn't there, and you can't trust any reality. And that's such a good example of someone using that yeah. tactic. Because I was watching it going, yeah, but obviously they can fit anything on the computer. Of course it can be faked. I'm not sure, because I don't watch that and feel that he's gaslighting. I think there's something else going on, and I think the laughter is a really interesting thing. Really you see it with Trump as well. Yeah. There's a Russian word called styob, and it's, it's, the, it's the idea that what you do is you sort of pretend to be something that everyone knows that you're not. And it's a really, really big sort of humour in Russia. And they... That, and basically, it's this idea that you all know that I don't really mean what I'm saying. We all understand that. We're all part of a gang that is part of a game that understands that I did murder that person. Yeah. And that actually, it's, it's become this really global, cynical performance. I think they're laughing because they know he's lying and he knows they know he's lying and we're all in a gang. Yeah. Well, I sort of think his publicity is a bit like that. So all that stuff where he's riding, like, with his top off on horseback. Mm -hmm. You know, he always looks like he's doing a Duke of Edinburgh award or something. <laughs> <laughs> it's, but it's kind of deliberately cartoonish. My mum fancies him. That's I mean, how bad... I, my... I don't not. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> don't do this again. <laughs> I can't help it, it's a condition. <laughs> and when he said, trust me, we're the good guys, I was like, yeah, I know he's a bad guy. I think he's... <laughs> you are the problem with democracy. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I did Google, is Putin single? <laughs> <laughs>